From the ancient sagas of Norse mythology come two gods, Odin and Loki. Odin, the Allfather, wise king of the gods, feared, reverenced, and loved. Loki, the trickster, a master of manipulation and deceit, both loved and loathed. We begin with Odin, ruler of Asgard, the lofty realm of gods. Odin was revered for his vast knowledge and wisdom, a leader whose presence commanded respect. He was deeply involved in safeguarding his realm and its inhabitants. Yet Odin's approach was not always honorable. His pursuit of knowledge sometimes took him to dark places, including betrayal and deceit. These gray areas in Odin's personality make him a complex and intriguing character to explore. Now let's turn to Loki. Known as the trickster god, Loki was a master of mischief and manipulation. While he was not the epitome of virtue, he was not entirely evil either. His actions, though often self-serving, were also known to aid the gods. Interestingly, Loki was not of divine birth. Born to giants, he was an outsider from the start. This fueled his desire to prove himself, often leading him to reckless and destructive actions. The relationship between Odin and Loki was complex. Odin saw potential in Loki's cunning and invited him into the Aesir, Asgard's divine family. Thus, they became blood brothers, sharing both bond and bickering. However, their relationship was fraught with tension. Loki's mischief often tested Odin's patience. His tricks ranged from harmless pranks to dangerous schemes that had far-reaching consequences, testing the limits of their bond. As time passed, Loki's actions grew more harmful. His pranks escalated to a point where he orchestrated the death of Odin's son, Balder. The death of Balder marked a turning point, and the friendship between Odin and Loki began to crumble. The Battle of the Gods, or Ragnarok, was the culmination of their conflict. It was prophesied that during this battle, Loki would lead the giants against the gods, heralding the end of the world. Despite their shared history and blood bond, Odin and Loki found themselves on opposing sides in this epic battle. Odin led the Aesir, fighting to protect their realm, while Loki, accompanied by the giants, sought to destroy it. The battle was fierce and bloody, reflecting the immense tension and hostility between these two gods. It was a battle where brother fought against brother, where loyalty was tested, and where destinies were fulfilled. The end was tragic for both. Odin met his death at the jaws of the wolf Fenrir, while Loki was slain by Heimdall, the guardian of the gods. In their deaths, they became symbols of the destructive power of pride, deceit, and betrayal. Yet, they also symbolized the duality of existence. Odin, with his wisdom and leadership, showcased the power of knowledge and the burden of responsibility. Loki, with his cunning and craftiness, embodied the chaos within us all. In the end, the story of Odin and Loki is a tale of two gods, both flawed and complex, waging a war sparked by rivalry, deceit, and broken bonds. It reminds us of the fine line between good and evil, and the price one pays for crossing it. Thank you for joining us in this exploration of the epic battle of the gods. Here's to the fascinating world of Norse mythology, where gods are human and humans are gods. We hope to see you in our next journey through the sagas.